Hey everyone, um, I was actually just doing some videos um, for my teaching and it's quite interesting because over the last couple of readings that I've been doing this week and also one that I listen to, a lot of people say to me, what is my purpose in life? Well, it's quite interesting because everybody has a purpose and we all have a purpose to, to come here and to heal and to grow. But sometimes we don't have a massive purpose. Sometimes we don't have this purpose of healing or we don't have this purpose of being a spiritual leader or we don't have a purpose of being, you know, someone's inspiration. Well, reality is, is we are always an inspiration to everybody. But our purpose here may be to help someone else just for a moment. It could be to be the mother of a gifted child. It could be to be the amazing accountant that you are. It could be for many, many reasons. So when people say, what is my reason for being on earth? What is my soul's purpose? Well, reality is, is there's naturally a healing capacity and that we're healing from past lives and we're healing from various different things. But we are here all on a journey. We're all on a journey encompassing everything for everybody. We're, we're a collective. We're journeying through life. We all have a purpose and we're all kind of pulling, pulling ourselves in. All right, we're all kind of pulling ourselves in. Um, we're intertwining ourselves into each person's life. And so we have a purpose in someone's life. We have a purpose in something else. We have purposes for various different things. It's not just one thing. So when people say, what's my purpose? It's for everything. My purpose on being on this earth plane is one, to be a mum for Charlie, two, to be a psychic medium, three, to be an inspiration, three, four, to, to share, my, share my gift with people. And I feel as though that when we are allowing ourselves to be in a vulnerable space, um, to not have to control what is my purpose and why are we here, I think it's so much better. So when you start thinking about what your purpose is, think about the smaller things. Think about the fact that your purpose today is to be a cook for someone. Purpose today is to put a smile on someone's face. And think about the purpose today. Because all of those little things, those little purposes are gonna to lead to the big purpose. You are here to make a difference. And you are gonna make a difference. So you don't have to stand up and be proud and loud and big about it, okay? Be proud about it, but it may be the smaller things. It may be just by putting someone's a smile on someone's face. It could be just to love someone. You just don't know. And so try to let go of what the purpose is and try to think about your purpose on a daily basis. And then when it comes to the end and when, when we're you know in spirit and we're looking back and you can actually see your purpose, you can see the reasons why you were here and just fulfilling. And it's about being the inspiration and allowing yourself to be the inspiration um, as well as a purpose. Okay, so it's kind of cool when you think about it that way. So that's what I, I, I've started to say to my, my clients is, you know, be an inspiration, be a purpose for the day. And naturally there are some people like, oh my God, they're a healer or they should be a writer or they should be this, they should be that. So I always say, you know, that's your purpose. But um, some people, you know, their purpose is just to change a life on a daily basis. And that's important. Anyway, just my little tidbit. I'm off to carry on recording now. Alrighty, have a great day. Bye.